So next question is question number 36. What is the pH of the resulting solution when equal volumes of 0.1 molar NaOH and 0.01 molar HCl are mixed? NaOH is a strong base. A strong base and quantity taken is 0.1 mole. HCl is a strong monoprotic acid. Acid and its quantity taken is 0.01 mole. Now both acid and base participate in chemical reaction which is known as neutralization reaction. The amount given here clearly shows that base is present in excess. It means after mixing the basic nature will dominate and basic nature it means pH of the mixture should be more than 7. Only one option is having value more than 7. So correct answer is third one. Option 3 is the correct answer. Next question of paper, question number 37. Number of possible isomers for the complex CO, E and twice Cl2 bracket close chlorine will be. First option 3, second option 4, third option 2, fourth option 1. Let us find the number of isomers. Formula suggests that this complex is an octahedral complex in which two of the ligands are ethylene diamine. This is ethylene diamine, ethylene diamine and these two chlorines. Now according to formula a structure of compound may be like this or a structure of this octahedral compound may be like this. It means two possibility exist. The given compound may be trans isomer or it may be cis isomer. So these two isomers are trans and cis. Now trans isomer is optically inactive but cis isomer is optically active. So two isomers will exist. One is dextro, one is levo. So total number of isomers for this complex is cis dextro compound, cis levo compound and this trans isomeric compound. So total number of isomers should be 3. So correct answer is first option. Next question is question number 38. The variation of the boiling points of hydrogen halides is in the order HF, HI, HPR, HCl. What explains the higher boiling point of HF? First option, the bond energy of HF molecule is greater than in other hydrogen halide. Second option, the effect of nuclear shielding is much reduced in fluorine which polarizes the HF molecules. Third option, the electronegativity of fluorine is much higher than for other elements in the group. Fourth option, there is a strong hydrogen bonding between HF molecule. The question is related to boiling point of hydrogen halides and as we know boiling point depends upon intermolecular forces of attraction. It does not depend upon electronegativity, it does not depend upon the bond energy. It only depends upon the type and strength of intermolecular forces of attraction. So HF permeates a strong hydrogen bonding between fluorine atom of one molecule and hydrogen atom of another molecule due to which its boiling point increases very much. So correct option should be the fourth one. It means fourth option is the correct answer. Next 